Fudge done gone. Classic. Oh, Fudge got him gone. Take a ride with us, we got it all. High rise to muscle cars. Turn the dream cruise class. I like that 66, no, but that's the A to go to fast. Chevelle on 4G Auto Rims. 101 whips, these ain't average. 269, 269, classic cars. 269, 269, classic cars. Alright, guys, we back with part two of the Mopar. We got a. Uh, Coming back with a Hellcat. There go another Hellcat. <laughs> but I'm crazy. I'm silly. Don't pay me no attention. Look at this uh, 392. 392 scat. Oh, you know what I want to show you guys? Let's go over here. Because I've seen two. Two. You know what is it? It's about four of them. Beautiful. Uh, what are they? Chargers? All four of them is nice, man. So I'm going to show you guys all four. Check them out. There they go right there. There they go right there. Man, all of them beautiful. With these two black ones, we'll get down there in a minute. We'll start with this rust color one. I don't know what the color would be called. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Come on, man. I'm showing you guys this. Now look what's on the side of me, dude. It's just a demon? It's a fucking demon. Get back to them in a minute. Today we are celebrating all things Chrysler. Damn it, with a hole in it. That's a demon. Yeah, I think only the demons come with this hood, matter of fact. You're only going to get a demon with that hood. So, but yeah, let me show you uh, these two right here, man. These are nice. And I love these wheels on it. Yeah, I love them wheels on there. Oh, wait a minute. Ooh. Black and orange interior. That's a win. Oh, he won. He won. He won. I was going to ask you guys which one you like. This one. Or this one. That's what it started his life out. And I tracked down the original owner. He won. Already with like these wheels. Over these wheels. But then, when I seen the black and orange, it just did it. It did it for me. I was trying to figure out which one I like. I think I'm going to go with the one with the Steelies, man. Like me too, see? <laughs> That's what I said. It just looks meaner. Mm -hmm. And then the black and orange interior did it yeah, for it me too. It <laughs> yeah, I seen the black and orange. I say, well, that did it. Yeah. The wheels is a great setup on this car, man. I like the wheels. Yeah. I mean, both of them nice. But oh, yeah. I would take either one. <laughs> either one, all right. <laughs> but that one there, nice. 1971. I've already been past there. I can't walk there again. 
And that's the number? <laughs> Both of them. Beautiful cars. All four of them is beautiful. Check them out. Old demon. This guy said he drove down here from Canada. You drove this from Canada or you trailered it? Trailer? Part of the highway is kind of rough in some spots. Yeah. This is, oh, look at the interior. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Almost missed out talking to you. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's nice. And the red line tire set it off. Yeah, that's the way they came with red line. Oh, it came like this? Yeah, that was standard. Okay. How many times you painted? It was painted in 91. 91? It's the original color, but it was resprayed in 91. Okay. Beautiful car. New bumpers. Recroned, yeah. Recroned them. Original bumpers, but recroned them. Recroned them. And uh, all new uh, lines, gas lines, fuel lines, suspension. Mm hmm Randy did all the work. I just Randy, you did the work? I keep it nice. He made it nice. Randy. I, I worked in for Chrysler since 1970. I retired 15 years ago. I love Mopars. Okay. I've been doing cars on the side. So when you work on it, it's not like work because you like doing it's it. It's a hobby, yeah. Yeah. I get paid to do my hobby now. Do your hobby, right. So a friend of mine's got 36 old cars, so I maintain them for them. Uh, you, did a, you did a hell of a job on this one. Oh, this, well, this car came out of Newfoundland mm -hmm. in Canada. Okay. So what's the chance of finding a car in Newfoundland? Right. So, yeah, this is nice. And Randy said, what do you want me to do to it? He said, pretend it's your car. Pretend it's your car. Because yeah, I know what he does. So you, I just. Let him go. Turn him loose. That's right. Turn him loose. That's the best way to do it. That's right. And Randy like it that way anyway, right? Oh, yeah. There's no other way. He doesn't want any help. Yeah. He said, he said clean up the engine compartment. So we pulled the motor out. Yeah, let's get the engine it. compartment. He cleaned it up. Yeah. Uh huh. Looks pretty good. Oh, it looked like it just came from the factory. He, he, he comes home. And I got the motor and everything out of the car. He said, what are you doing to my car? I said, well, that's the way you got to do it right. Do it right. That's right. He pulled the grill out and uh, just cleaned it all up. Kept it all original, but cleaned it up. Man, that looked nice. That's beautiful. That looked like it just came out the assembly line. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's how you want it. Yeah, that's how I want to Keep it factory. Yeah, Randy know what he's shit. doing. That's right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Randy know what he's doing. Cause that yeah. looked damn. Yeah. Well, it's all that little detail. You got to take that little extra time. Mm-hmm. You did. <laughs> you did. This is nice. Now, do you have one of these, Randy? I just sold mine. I had a 71 Duster. Mm -hmm. I sold it. I bought a, a brand new Plum Crazy Hellcat. That oh. car's going to get me in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You got a Hellcat? What year? Uh, 2023. 2023 Hellcat. Oh, yeah. That's a fun car, right? Eh? So, this guy right here, we don't know how long he's going to have license. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we don't know how long <laughs> he's going to. You're right. <laughs> Most wanted. <laughs> Most wanted. Did you change the top? Nope. No original top? I'd like to say yes, but I don't know that for sure. Mm hmm. Bill Sheep. I'm thinking yes, with the interior was original. We had to do some touch up and paint, you know, but uh, I like the you, wheels. I put the 68 wheels on, I like those better. Yeah, I love the wheels. Yeah, the 69, I, I don't like the wheels. So These 68 wheels? Yeah, because yeah. the 69 had a trim ring and they were a smaller wheel. Mm -hmm. they, don't, they don't fill out the wheel well enough. Oh, okay. So this uh, made the car look a little better, so I took that liberty. And I think that's it. Basically, I think I had every option except cruise control. From the factory this is a beautiful car oh my goodness what is that i heard about these things i don't know but i heard about these um eight tracks, eight -tracks. <laughs> yeah. that's what it is the eight tracks eight track tape yeah, yeah the eight track tape 
Yeah. Now wow. it doesn't work any longer, but in the day that was a that was the thing, thing right? Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not so much anymore. Man, the interior looked just as good as the uh, exterior. Yeah, and underneath uh, also. Underneath the car as well. Oh, yeah, let's the frame see. and everything. Everything is like very, very. It could put in a. You could put in a showroom to me. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. 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 It's definitely showroom yeah. ready. So and like it runs as good as it looks. Man, it's Barry Jackson ready. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell my wife that. Yeah, she could be ready to put it up yeah, there, huh? Yeah. yeah. Actually, we were in Carlisle last week. Uh huh. Uh, the big car car show in Carlisle. Okay. And, uh, Ronnie got a first place for this in yeah. his category. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they beat out some Hemi cars. Yeah. So, because of the creature features and the originality. Yeah, this is a beautiful car, man. Yeah. This well, is beautiful. We were discussing when whoever ordered this car back in 69, mm -hmm. everybody wanted to go fast. Right. So, like Ronnie says, it's probably like a gentleman's muscle car. Yeah. You know, yeah. Power windows, air conditioning, and the big motor. Beautiful. Yeah. All right, man. Enjoy, man. Yeah. Randy, you are the man. <laughs> you are the man. Go and snatch them gears. <laughs> nice. You guys take care, man. You too. I guess I'll see you next year. Take care, when, when, I, when I see you, I want to see that Hellcat. Okay. <laughs> With your license intact. Okay. Will do. All right. Cool guys right there, man. This is nice. Hold on, I gotta get the plate, Ron. <laughs> Ron's our teeth. All right. Look at this. Look how they didn't change from that RT to this right here. You have a channel that you show things on? I do. Oh, yeah? I do. Okay. Check it out. It's a 269 Classic Cars. 269 Classic Cars. 269 Classic Cars. You're going to see me uh, with your car on there. Make okay. sure you subscribe to the channel. Will do. Okay. Okay. If not, I'm going to tell the police you are speeding. Yeah. <laughs> Watch out. 269 Classic Cars. Okay. Very good. Thank All right. You. All right, guys. Oh, look, check out the old wagon. It's just wagon is pretty dang on solid. I wouldn't mind having this. Belvedere. It's my solid wagon. All right, man. This was uh, part two of the Mopar show. I think uh, I done showed you guys everything they got out here, or maybe not. You know what? I believe that. Is that a TRX? That's the first TRX. It might be the only TRX I done seen out here. They got some parts out here they be selling, too. Swap meeting. Is that a TRX? Why not? Guess what? Still ain't seen a TRX yet. That's a damn Dodge Rebel. Just thought about that. I ain't seen not one TRX out here. Check out this hearse. It's pretty cool. Like this color combination. Check out the interior. Man, check out the wheels. Love them wheels. That 
got them rim bros. Who's we'll just sitting up in here? Pretty nice. This right here, Plymouth. Like old police car. Matter of fact, it is like that. When I showed in the first video, the uh, uh, what was that? The uh, state trooper. That's what that looked like. Old police car. Just gonna walk down here. Man, I ain't seen no TRX. That's crazy. The TRX or Mopar? Imperial, get you some of that. Look at that dash. Ooh, look at the old school camera. Camera might be worth a change to a collector. front end to get to the motor. Cotton Willies. Someone chop a small block and you're like. Got a road runner. Ain't too much out here for sale, fellas. Uh, look who coming. Look at my boy. Look at my boy, Scat Pack Rod. Scat Pack Rod. Oh boy, Scat Pack Rod got here in that thing. Who the hell you the kill, Rod? How you doing, Rod? Not too bad. How you been? 
How long you been out here? Man, for a minute. About to get out of here. Uh, I had to get you? back to work. Yeah, you've been to bed all day. Yeah, I had, <laughs> I had to make a couple stops. Make a couple stops. I hear you. you looking you good? Look where the park, I'll be back. All right, go ahead. Check out Road One. Oh, how in the hell did I not see you today? You tripping, tripping. You tripping, tripping, bro. How did I miss this today? I don't know. I don't know. This, this, there's only one of these in the world. In the world. Literally. Literally. No two ways about it. It's the only one. Only, this yours? Yes. Oh my goodness. I, in the world, I was walking by, I say, what am I doing? How did I not see that? It's, it's a new Hellcat with the Challenger, with the Challenger cut off and this body put on. Ooh. We oh. used every stitch of it, the interior. Mm -hmm. every, everything the Hellcat had, it still has, it all works. Everything's, everything works. Wow. One of one. One of one, literally. Literally. <laughs> Same thing. You can't tell where one stopped and the other one started. It's crazy. Yeah. I got about four years in. Yeah. Four years? Almost four years. A couple months shy of. I've only had it done for a couple months. This is the first Mopar doings I've been to. Uh huh. And, and it took me just under four years to do it. This is crazy. Look at the interior. It wouldn't have took that long to do, but life, you know how life is. Yeah. I got I got a super stock car that I race, and I got two businesses. So I did it in my spare time, <laughs> which is, well, I went out and worked on it about every night. It seemed like. I just can't imagine. There's so much stuff here that you can't see. This thing's, this thing's got five rings. That, that hole in the bumper is just dropped into the inner cooler, and that was just dropped into the oil cooler. It's from every piece. That the spoiler is a factory Challenger spoiler. The, the piece between the spoiler and the bumper that was about two and a half months to make that adapter. Wow. <laughs> the dash. Months and months and months and months. It was. Got strut towers. Hold on. Yeah, look inside yeah. the car. Every piece that come out of the Hellcat went back in. Went back in. What? What did everything? Say, the, the door panels and all. We we, we even recontoured the doors to match the door. This thing, keyless entry, all that crap. We cut the panels until they fit the door. And what did fit? We made a piece, we covered it with the material, and then we built the doors out. I wanted it to look like a door. Yeah, this this come out of a, a modern a, yeah, a challenger door. I cut the, the end out of the door and so I could use all the the, the lock skin. crap and then we had to cut the post back to get it to fit and the back's the same way. We built it the interiors it's it's all what didn't fit we made panels and covered till they do. <laughs> yeah. Me, me, me and my brother-in-law, two, two guys built this car. Two guys. Two guys. Me and her brother. He's the body man. It took me about a year to get him on board. He thought I was nuts for the first year. <laughs> I worked on it for about a year before he'd even look at it. Now, who idea was the back window defroster? <laughs> it had one, so I put one on this one. <laughs> right. I, I wanted everything to work, so I, everything that it had, it still has. Still has. Yep. Yeah, I heard it. It, it sounds like a new car. Yeah. It's amazing. It's crazy what you can do to these cars, man. I probably had the body off of that. Look at this. This is amazing. On and off and on and off and on and off. Fitting and cutting and fitting and cutting. It was a lot of work. Ah. This 
this is amazing. And other people, it's just an old part. And, and, and then you can, the people that know, know what I went through. Yeah. It's just another car. <laughs> you went through a lot. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was a pretty serious undertaking. My wife wanted a new Hellcat and I wanted an old Super Duty. We got a 69 Roadrunner, a blue body, and, and she's got an 09 Hellcat. Or, uh, yeah, that's nice. And I was out in the back building with the tape measure for about two months before it was fixed. <laughs> I'm going, I know I can make this work. I just know. And I after can. showing you guys this it's right here, you got to share the video. Got to let somebody see this, man. Tell a friend, tell a cousin, tell a neighbor. Check this out, man. You never know what 269 Classic Car is going to bring you. Man. Hit that like button for me, man. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think of this bad boy right here. And on that note, we're going to have to uh, cut this one off right here, man. What better way to stop the video after something like this? I don't think nothing else can follow this up. So on that note, 269 Classic Cars, we gone. Out. 269, 269 Classic Cars. 269, 269 classic cars.